All right, here are a couple tips on how to beat knockback clutch on hard difficulty. Tip number one is you want to be looking down with about a 45 degree angle. If you look straight ahead, then doing that is difficult. If you look down, easy peasy. Second tip, don't jump. When you jump and you take knockback, uh, you take a lot, a lot more knockback. Uh, you're going to get used to the timing of whenever you take knockback, you know, because it's, it's, it's at a regular interval. So when you arrive at the stairs, uh, what you want to do is you want to wait till you take knockback and then you walk up the stairs. Wait till you next take knockback and then walk up the stairs. You don't want to be caught jumping and then taking knockback. Easy peasy, just like that. See, I was actually in the air there when I took the knockback, which would make me take way more. But we're fine, we're fine, we're professional. So this part's actually really easy. If you want, you can just make... I cut that out. Uh, so I can talk. All right, so this is the easiest part of the course, if you ask me, because you have you you still have like I don't know, 85 blocks left. If I want to, I can just make the bridge way larger. You know, you know, you're not gonna get the best. You're not gonna get the best time if you do the the slow and steady strategy. But hey, you're gonna be able to tell your friends. Oh, you know that hard thing on that server? Yeah, I beat that easy peasy. And then you're gonna be they're gonna be like, oh. How did you beat it? And you're gonna be like, oh, well, I watched Twitcher Thomas's TikTok video, and you should watch it too. And then, and then I get all the clout. You see, you see, you picking up what I'm putting down. And easy peasy. See, one minute and thirty seconds. That's not bad. That's not bad. So there you go. That's that's. That's how you, that's how you, that's how you beat it. Good luck. Good luck. I believe in you. Okay, bye.